Plans to expand the Carpenters Local 277 Union will triple the size of its training center. It's to ready for big developments taking place from Micron to the I-81 project. They're going to need to recruit and they've already started. News Channel 9's Iris St. Moran talks with both these students who received some hands-on experience at the center. Jacob Sides, a senior at Lyons High School, is testing out a laser measuring system at the Carpenters Local 277 Training Center. So I'm a very hands-on learner, and just like the hands-on portion of it, it just really helps me retain knowledge. He joins about 400 other students from across the region who are visiting the center this week for an open house. He plans to pursue carpentry when he graduates. My mom forced me to go into the Bullshit program for carpentry, and I ended up loving it, so that's really how I became to want to do this opportunity. The union wants to provide this exposure to give students an idea, but also to help them recruit. They plan to triple the size of this training facility to meet the development demands with Micron and the I-81 project. In construction, there, you know, pretty much every single trade is available. Obviously, we're the Carpenters Union, so we think that we're the trade that's uh, the best. And, uh, you know, there, it's just a wide variety of what carpentry actually consists of. Blanche Wolf wants to get into heavy machinery, but she enjoyed learning this aspect of construction. Broaden your horizon, I guess, which seems very controversial, but if you can go and explore a gazillion different trades, do it. You got that real close. And that's exactly what they all did. In Syracuse, Iris St. Moran, News Channel 9. And the union isn't just recruiting students. If you have an interest in carpentry, we have more for you at localsyr.com.